previously on The Walking <gasps> Dead. Ooh. It looks like somebody's hey looting, there. but nobody's looting. Trucks run out of gas. Fuck! We're trapped! Oh. Ah! Oof. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. <laughs> oh, sorry. I I should not try to. I should not try to act um, as a walker. Uh oh. Right there. Go. 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 What's up, everybody? Welcome back to The Walking Dead, the Telltale Definitive series. Holy shit! Wow. Oh my god, we had a little bit of trouble in the pharmacy, as you could tell. By the way, I'm tempted. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Uh, I, could, I would shake your hand, but... Yeah, you're... Yeah. Okay. Anyways, where we left off, we had a little bit of trouble. We had a little run-in with uh, Lily and the gang. Uh, Lily um, and, uh, and the gang. Uh, Larry. We had Lily, Larry, uh, Carly, uh, Doug, and Glenn. Those are the people that we ran into. Of course, we are Lee Everett with Clementine in one of the back offices here, uh, which it looks to me, looks like it's a mess. So yeah, but we're, we're gonna continue on. We're gonna do our, our stuff. We're gonna strut our stuff and whatnot. And um, <clears throat> we're going to try to get out of the pharmacy. That is the goal now. We gotta get some medicine and we gotta get out of the pharmacy. So be prepared. We are getting close and nearing close to the end of episode one, season one. Well, season one, episode one. That's, this is that's how it is. Cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Yeah. And was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. And as you guys know already, I love my tea or coffee when I'm my doing recordings as well as streams. Smart like I always have tea and coffee, always. Honestly, if you guys don't know me and you see a person that made a video or is streaming with tea or coffee, that person is me. That person is me, okay? I'm always the one that uh, does this, this door clear, huh? sort of stuff with tea Can or coffee. Sure. Maybe even sometimes you'll see me sh we um, eating Watch as well. You'll see me tools. eating. You don't need anything, right? Things have been scary, huh? How you doing? How, How you doing? doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. Mm, no, no, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Uh, let's see. Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. I'm not crazy about it either. Yeah, I'm not crazy I'm about not soccer either it. myself. Actually, as a matter of fact, I kind of find soccer to be a little bit boring, in my opinion, you know. <laughs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Uh... Uh, I would blame them. Uh, I wouldn't blame them. I wouldn't blame them. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. Uh, we didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I should help, but keep that between us. I'm not a bad guy. I got into some trouble and then I didn't talk to him for a while. Yeah. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, let's get this done. I'm going to try to tell Clementine the truth because I I always want to be honest 
to uh, Clementine. Are you okay? uh, that's that's, that's my goal is to be honest to Clementine. Oh. That's my goal. All right. Well, sit you on up there. Find a band aid. Uh, I think there's a band aid in here, right? Or is this the remote? No, that's the remote. Um. Oh fuck. The remote to my dad's TV. Yeah. There we go. Uh, go over here. There should be a first aid. Yep. There we go. Go over here, and let's take a look, shall we? Let's have a look at that finger. Uh, Ow! It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Uh, bandit. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. What? Are we going to disinfect it? No disinfection? Oh my God! You're going to get infected. Not that you're already infected, but. Lee. Yeah. Yeah. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find us. I don't think they will. Ah, oh, I mm. want to be honest. I want to. I asked you a question. Yeah, I know. Um, They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah. 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 Okay. I, I, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. We should keep a lookout. I'm gonna keep I the optimism. I in case they try that way. I'm gonna keep the Stay optimism. To me until then, okay? Oh man, I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna do the optimism because. Uh, yeah, God knows, you know, you need it. You need to have faith. You need to have we faith. Need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. All right. Well, I got a remote. Um, I don't know if I need to go outside or not. Oh yeah. And the picture. The picture. Lee's family. Damn. Find anything? Oh, Carly. Just a picture, a photo of the family that home placed. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. Hmm. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. <sighs> Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> yeah. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? Uh, what's, what's it to you? you? To me? I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong yeah. on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. How, How can, can I, I trust, trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other options. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask how I could trust her. Although I do kind of want her trust, but I mean, you know, when it's I whatever. Back into the drugstore with me. Okay. Lee? Oh dear. Here comes the question. You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Yeah. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No. Um. No, he wasn't. Yeah, oh. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be honest with you, Clem. Was he bad? I'm gonna be honest. Yikes. Oh boy. Okay. Well, now that we got that whole hey thing out of the way. Oh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam. jam. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Mm. Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. Yeah, we'll totally. Hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? <coughs> I'll take good care of it. What do you think? 
I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do. Hell so yeah, it is. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Could use a jog? Well, guess what? We're going to head out now. Because, uh, you know. Ain't no point in waiting around. I've already collected enough as is here. So, yeah. Are you okay? You ready to head out? You ready to head out? <laughs> you got it. You? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. I've already talked to everybody. I've already done all that I could. I've already collected everything that I could. So... Out to the motel we go. Get down. Right. Oh, excuse me. Damn. That is quite a bit of roamers, that's for sure. Oh yeah. But a little bit indeed. <clears throat> did you see that? Sure did. Be ready to shoot. Don't shoot, it's Glenn. Oh man. Glenn? There we go. Wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost. She's died. saying that she is bitten. In the ice machine. Lucky you. Oh Let's my go. god. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. Nah, now we're not. Or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Nah, it's it's not like that. All right, so we got two up there, one down there, uh, one by the RV. Well, there's two actually by the RV. One right here, and then one right behind the RV. So we got we got two that are there. Uh, I think the first thing that we're going to be doing. We don't know how hard it's going to be to get her out of It's not going to be that hard. So we have to kill every one of them in here quietly. Noise attracts these things. Let's have a look around. I, I already know what to do. So I need to go, I think, this way. I believe. I think I need to go this way. Oh, yeah, and then there's that one that's kind of laying down. Um, let me see if there's anything in the window. There's a screwdriver, but I can't break the glass. Ah! Oh, no, that's just the same. Ah, my bad. My bad. All right, so no, 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 I can't go that way. I'm gonna have to go back this way. There's, uh, I know that there's a pillow somewhere. Gotta be a pillow somewhere. I think it's right here. Yeah, it's this one. Yeah, there we go. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. All right, now we can go back over here. My bad. I did a mistake. I did a boo boo. But we will be able to do this. Just, just give me a minute. Give me one lick and pick a minute. All right, now we gotta go over here. Smother. Gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. There you go. That was sick. Yeah. Hell yeah, it was. <laughs> All right, so there you go. That's one dead. Uh, we're gonna open up the car. And if I am a correct mando, spark plug, there we go. And then put this in neutral. Okay, now we push the car. Just like so. Crushes that zombie. Doesn't necessarily kill him. But it will it will make him 
Yeah, it will make him immobile. Is that, is that the word to use? Immobile? Immobile? I don't know. Okay, now we gotta go over here to the car window, or, or the truck window, and we get this thing out, and Glenn tells us to wait. Let me see the spark plug. He's gonna take the spark plug, gonna step on it, and get some porcelain. There you go. <coughs> and now. There you go, see? Look at that. We are amazing. And now I'm gonna grab the screwdriver. The screwdriver is now mine. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Hell yeah. Alright, now we can go back over to our original spot. So we've already kind of got two, well, one and a half, right? And here's what I'm actually going to do. I'm actually going to go over here. And just like that. There we go. That's two and a half. Do that. Get ready to scrabble an egg. I'll wait for him to get closer. Yeah. Oh shit. There we go. There you go. Look at that. And bam. Oh, went right inside of him. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> there you go. Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Hell yeah, we do. <clears throat> no, we ain't done. We ain't done at all. Not yet. Two more. That Two more. Help. Hell yeah, it should. Alright, so now what we gotta do, we gotta actually sneak up the stairs. Like so. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Hell yeah, you will. And if you're not behind me, then I guess I have two extra eggs to scramble. I mean, that's that's if they don't, yeah, listen to me. Okay, we got this, we got this. We're getting close to finishing this, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure we are. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, decapitated. And then this is where we find the woman, the lady. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. No. She's not in trouble, she's just... Stop! Just stop! I'm coming out. She's been bitten. <laughs> You're hurt. Oh god. I... I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. Sheesh. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. Oh, I god want damn. That. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Oh. What if you turn and come after us? Come with us, we will help. Come with us. We will find you some help. Oh boy. You have a gun. So, so? can I borrow it? What do you mean borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this and then oh boy. there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Uh, we can't let you. Yeah, do we that can't let yourself. you do that, man. And do it for me. A difficult choice. Give it to me, please. This oh, is crazy. Boy. 
Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Yes. Back up. Please! Oh, shit. And there goes the balcony. Yep. And there goes the gun. And... Yeah, Whoa, she's it picked it up. Just wanna help. You can't. Oh, come on. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find think. you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... No, no! no! Yep, there she goes. It's the apocalypse. It makes people go insane. God damn. Let's get out of here. Yeah, see, here that's why... That's one of the many reasons why I didn't want to give get the gun in. to her. It's because of that. A lot of... A lot of infected. Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and well yeah. We're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is oh, getting boy. those pills out of the pharmacy. Yep. And we are getting close. We're getting very close, actually. All right, so now that I've done that, I want to go over here. Uh, we're going to talk to Glenn. How you doing, Glenn? You know. What's his story, Glenn? What's your next move? Back the motor in. Back the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know when things are taken away. Yeah. Do crazy shit. I guess. That's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. That's good. 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 I guess she really wanted that gun. Seems like. Damn. Why didn't you tell Carly to just give it to her? What, bruh? Would you have given it to her? Yeah. No way. Then you know why. Yeah. What's your story, Glenn? Yeah, what's your story? Around here. I brought a couple to the Everts a few times. Sorry. I mean, the folks that own this place. Just really good people. It sucks seeing this place like this. There's yeah, it does. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. True. I know, the feeling, man. I know that feeling, too. Try to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, right. I know that feeling, too. Alright, let's, uh, let's talk to Carly. I don't know if she's gonna be... All hung up about that. Story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts. You do right. True. That's right. Well, until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding, and I hit the blogosphere. Hmm. That radio sign-off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. Mm. You don't have to be. It's traumatic. I'm sure True. some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. Eh, well. Gotta uh, stay concerned. Alright, let's talk to Kenny one more time. Kenny, Katja, and Duck. How are we doing? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. You got it. All right. Well, just wanted to check up. So I don't think uh, Lily and Larry are going to be very chattable as well. So we're going to have to talk to Doug. Ever seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Want to step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Mm-hmm. Uh, huh. uh, yeah, let's have a look around. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring him back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Oh, no worries. We're going to make a lot of noise, but it ain't going to be close to us. At least, not anytime soon. But, yeah. Jesus. 
Oh boy. I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh god damn. Ah! Revert your eyes, people, for those that cannot, um... Yeah, I can't handle this type of stuff. eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Ew. How the fuck? Sheesh. I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. You know, I always wondered, what, uh... That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? How how the hell did uh um, so this in the office? Did this whole thing happen no anyways? Idea. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe yeah. there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. I can't reach that brick. Ah, of course. Okay. So we gotta do this then. There we go. Awesome. Now yeah. Distract those things. Yes. Oh, I know. I know how to do it. I can't reach that brick. Are you kidding? Are you serious, Bruh. Um. E let's see. Right here. I know how to do this. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do. What's that? It's universal. It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? It's a universal remote. You can do that with the universal I remote. I all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. There you go. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Alright, now... One problem with this game is that the crosshairs in the center there, they're always glitching on cinematic cutscenes like this, and I do apologize for that. I don't know how to fix that. I would not know how to fix that whatsoever. Ridiculous. Can't reach that brick. How can you Oh, right. Right, 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 right. Gotta open it a little bit, and then we can get it. Yeah. Now we can get the brick. And throw it all the way over there. There we go. That's gotta work. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Now's the time. Hell yeah. <clears throat> Be careful. Oh, I will. I'm always careful. You know me. You know me. I'm always careful. Oh, boy. Yep. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to Mom and Dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. That's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. Shut up, Doug. Jesus. Should have left. I'm sorry I wasn't there. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But no one yeah. knew to take care of them tomorrow. That helped. That's his brother. That's why. That's Lee's brother. And... There you go. Good scare for ya. A oh, nice good scare. Oh, come on, Lee. Right in the noggin. There you go. There you go, Lee. Right in the, right in the noggin. Ooh, it looks like it got concaved, indeed. Oh, God. 
Come on. Bottle it up. There you go. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Stomach it. There we go. And we got the keys. Hell yeah. Holy crap! Run! As they turn around, they just turn around. I think it's because like once you kill one of their own, one of one of the dead there, the rest of the dead they can kind of sense it. And they're like, oh, our, our, our buddy has been killed, you know, let's go kill them. Blah, 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 blah. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. Yeah. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get Am it. I, though? Am I, though? This one might be a little bit longer than usual. So, I mean... Oh, no, I don't want that. Oh, why... Why did it do that? There we go. I don't know. The, the controller's being weird. I may have to switch back to uh, PC and all that. Mouse and keyboard. But, oh, no. hey, look at that. Shit. We gotta hurry. Yes, we do. Yes, indeed we do. We gotta hurry. Yeah. Oh boy. They're all coming towards us now. They're all coming towards us. Man, you know, I'm such a huge fan of The Walking Dead. Uh, well, not like a huge fan, but I'm a fan, of course, of The Walking Dead. I have seen the, the entire series. I am on Fear of the Walking Dead now, which is kind of weird, kind of strange, but yeah. And yeah, this is, I think this is the last part. When you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. Yes, Lee, sir. You take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. I that door's not locked anymore. Oh, Shit. boy. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Oh, oh shit. Here we go. Some quick time events and such as. Well, not really quick time events, but yeah. If you don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. Uh, we'll make it through this. We will make it through this. Doug, yes, we will. We don't make it through this. You should know. Oh shit! Come on. I know what? Huh? You said I should know. Oh shit! Are you sure? Oh shit! Oh, oh. Okay then. Give it time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? The cane. The cane. Get the cane. Uh oh. Uh oh. Did you find anything? Nothing. Wait. A window with screws. Go. I got this. Oh, here we go. Here we go. There we go. I found something. All right, it's the cane. Grab it. There we go. I'll hold for a little bit. Oh shit. Doug. All right, I'm sorry. I mean, this is kind of, this This is kind of like, you know, like, come on, like, you could just easily curve stomp him right there with the other foot, maybe. And then this part, I mean, I get it, you know, kind of hard. But this is my playthrough. I'm sorry, but I'm helping Carly. I'm sorry. I'm helping Carly. I had to save one. They, they got dodged. They... There we go. Run, run, Clem, run. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, what a bitch. Ow. Uh. Uh. Oh, there you go. Somebody else get eaten today. Especially a good friend. Hell yeah. 
God damn, look at that. Whew. Whew -whew. All right, so yeah, this one is definitely going to be one of those uh, longer ones for sure. But uh, yeah, this is this is basically the ending of season one, episode one. Ugh. Clementine's like, ugh, gross. Ugh, what a mess. Ah, oh, there's the girl. Yep, just saw the girl. Yeah, there she is, right in the center. Ah, oh, damn. You know, that's that's really weird. It's really weird, you know. It's like... Ah. Not, not... I wouldn't say weird. It's, it's just like... Jesus, like, you know, a whole lot has happened already. Yeah, a lot of gunfire. Screaming. Gunfire and screaming. This is where... This is where the power goes out as well. Okay, there you go. Let's uh, talk to Glenn. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah, I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening here. Mm. We left a few days ago. Could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Can you just look over there? Everything we own would be lost if I left you alone for five minutes. I don't know. Don't do it, Lily. It's his choice. You gotta let people do what people do. It's exactly what it's like. Find your friends. I, I think that's the wrong call. You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Goodbye, Glenn. Goodbye, Glenn. Whether it be the wrong, right call, does not matter. I, I really hate the stupid uh, cursor glitch. I really do. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. That's Earlier, one stupid glitch I, I hate. I may have to use... What you're gonna do if Clementine's parents don't show. I may have to use mouse and keyboard next time. Happen? Her parents showed up? No, I don't. Well, I want you to know that I think you've got it in you. I think you can take care of that little girl just fine. Oh, I know I can. I know I can. You got it. All right. How about you, Katja? No? Not Katja? Okay, let's go down over here. There we go, Carly. How are you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I, I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. Yeah, he liked you too, but I... I Wait. like you more. Mm-hmm. Yes. What is it? I'm sorry, I, I don't like Doug. Did I, I didn't like Doug. I don't like we Doug at all. Needed you. You picked me. As I said, I have played this. Oh, hang on. Uh, I thought you can help, but then... Uh, oh. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Now, like as I said before, I have played this game a long, 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 long time ago. Uh, when it first came out. And I went for Carly first, and I like Carly. The oh, man, last time I did go for Doug when I was trying to do a different uh, different playthrough of it, and it just it didn't feel right. It didn't feel right at all. I was like, ew, what the hell? Hey Duck, you want to cool it? God damn that fucking cursor, man! That cursor, man! Ah, oh, I don't like it. Get rid of it. No, it's 
not that. It's. I Is it the controller? Again. I don't know if it's the controller. I may have to unplug the controller, plug it back in. I don't know. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I I apologize for the cursor, everybody. I apologize for the cursor. It's it, It's the game. It's glitched. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another. I I unplugged my mouse. I did unplug the mouse. Because you guys did hear that. Come here for a second. Not like we have much to begin. Let me go deal with this. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. And I'm sweating. Holy you crap. Okay, you like my daughter? Uh, her dad tried to kill me, so. Her dad tried to kill me, so. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are, and I don't give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Oh boy. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? Oh boy. God, that, that cursor, man. That cursor. My would be dead if it weren't for you. It's bugging me, man. It's bugging me. And I'm pretty sure it bugs you guys as well. And I am sorry about that. So next time when we do do another let's play of this, uh, we will be, um, I will be disconnecting controller and we'll be doing some keyboard and mouse instead. I hope that's the sound of us winning this Although it is going to be a little bit tougher for me. Me too. Because I never played this game with keyboard and mouse. I never did. off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Mm -hmm. Me too. Mm -hmm. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. And now. Yeah. There you guys go. There you have it. That has been. Season 1, Episode 1 of The Walking Dead. Oh, next time on The Walking Dead. Sorry. We're not done yet. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Don't repeat what happened with the walkers at Herschel's farm. You choose the kids this time. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The walkers don't worry me as much as the bears. You fucked with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Yeah! No more, please. No more, please. Please, please. Starved for help, episode two. Oh boy. Ooh, it's getting juicy. Ooh. All right, let's see what we got here. Honesty lied to Herschel. You and fifty-four percent of players were honest. Who would you save, Duck or Sean? You and you and forty-eight percent of players chose Sean. Loyalty side with Kenny. You and fifty-four percent of players defended Kenny. Mercy gave Irene the gun. You and fifty-three percent of players refused to give her the gun. Who would you save, Doug or Carly? You and forty-nine percent of players chose Carly. What? So more people chose Doug. Hmm. You know, I'm actually kind of surprised by that. I'm actually kind of uh, a little bit surprised by that, but. There you guys go. There you guys have it. That has been Telltale's The Walking Dead Definitive Series, Season 1, Episode 1. What do you guys think, like, of the playthrough here, of the Let's Play? Do you guys think that uh, me talking over the characters a little bit here and there is good? Or would you guys want me to shut up and you guys be able to hear the dialogue and whatnot? Uh, I do apologize if, you know, I do talk over the dialogue 
Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to shut up so you can listen to the story and feel it for yourselves. And not having that other random white creamy ass looking like person as I point to myself talking over the dialogue and such as. Um, yeah, but there you go. That's the Walking Dead episode one. Thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you guys are enjoying this, make sure to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Don't have to sub. You don't want to sub button. Show stuff for city giggles. Rip aside the sub button. the bell. If you touch it, that bang the bell. Y'all yeah, notifications when I go live or when I upload a video. And if you guys want to see more Let's Plays, gameplays, walkthroughs, and, play and playthroughs, check out my Twitch channel. Links and everything are in the description below. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.